One thing I'm learning with this content creation is that you can't please everybody. Okay, you can't please everybody. Even if you have a target audience, even if you feel like you've created this audience for yourself, there's always somebody. There's always somebody judging you. There's always somebody looking for what's wrong with you. There's just always someone looking for flaws or insecurities in what you have to say or what you're doing. Okay, so these videos are not for you. Let me remind you. These videos are for me. These videos are a documentary of my journey becoming a content creator. And it's not pretty. It's not perfect. It's not beautiful. It's fucking ugly. It's ugly, but it's growth. It's growth in myself. And I'm seeing myself grow with every single video I make. They might not all be bangers, but I'm staying consistent enough to feel like I'm growing. And that's all that, that's all that matters to me. That's all that counts because effort is everything. Effort in yourself is everything. And if you don't have any effort in yourself, you're not growing as a person. And I'm not trying to tell people what to do. I'm not trying to tell you how to live your life. I'm just trying to give my experience as a person and see how it runs, see how, see how people take it. And quite honestly, not everyone takes it the same way. And you know, I'm just starting to learn this. I really want to project my opinion and my opinion only. I'm not letting anyone flood into my thoughts because my thoughts are mine. My opinions are mine. My perspective is mine. And that's why I'm sharing it because it's mine. And it's so, it's so genuine. And I believe everyone should hear my opinion. Everyone should hear my perspective. It doesn't mean it's correct. I'm not trying to tell people that my opinion is the only opinion that matters. Hell no. But people are taking you like that. So that's why I'm just saying you can't please everyone and you're not for everyone. You're for yourself. Even with a significant other, even with a sister, a brother, your parents, you're not for everyone. You're not gonna please everyone. You're not gonna make everyone happy. You're not. The person who should, you should make happy is yourself. I'm happy. I'm happy that I'm making these videos. I'm happy that I'm being consistent, you know? And like I said, not all these videos are bangers, but I'm really finding myself through these videos. I'm finding myself as a creator and I want to start taking it in a really good direction. These documentation videos are the most genuine videos that I feel like I've found in, in myself as a content creator. You know, I've tried making shorts, reels on Instagram. I've done like some TikTok videos. Instagram and TikTok have become so ingenuine and so like such a false sense of creativity that I just took it to YouTube. I've never been a YouTube girl. I've never, I don't really have many, like I don't subscribe to a lot of people. One of the main YouTubers that I used to watch was Bethany Moda, okay? And this was like 2013, 2012, when she was on the rise with Tumblr and all. That was my YouTube girl, okay? That was my, that was my ish. That was all I knew about YouTube. I don't know shit about YouTube. I just started dropping genuine videos. And these videos have become a big self-growth milestone for me because talking to myself, talking to this camera right now is just projecting a confidence that I should feel every single day of my life and it's going to get better and better and better and it's only up from here so whoever got anything negative to say keep saying it dead ass please keep saying it because you can't please everyone and controversy sells okay controversy sells that's a main that's a big point <laughs> even it's if it's a positive or negative comment it doesn't matter because the controversy is what sells. The attention is what sells. If, if saying something gives someone a positive perspective and it also gives someone a negative perspective, isn't that just selling, selling you the perspective alone? Because it doesn't matter what you think. It doesn't matter what your opinion is on my opinion because my opinion is mine. My perspective is mine. There's a lot of there's a lot of creators out there that bend the rules. They bend their personality to the audience. And I hate seeing it. I hate seeing people not become themselves when they're creating because you are the creation. 
you are the creativity you are the person that creates what people want and if it's ingenuine then it just goes nowhere this genuine video right now is just proving that you can't please everyone okay and I really hope that you can take this as inspiration, as motivation to create your own videos and be yourself in those videos. Don't alter yourself. I'm not saying to not edit. Edits are, you know, really, really cool. A lot of people do some really cool edits out there and I don't take that away from anybody. But I'm taking these documentations of my videos as a growth, as a self-growth project for myself. And you can't please everyone with what you want for yourself. You can't, because it's for yourself, it's for me. So why should I care what anyone thinks? Why should I care what anyone like, ha like has an opinion on? It's, it's my opinion, okay? And I'm choosing to project them into the world and I'm choosing to grow from whatever I'm doing. I'm choosing to grow.